Hello Virgo, welcome to Faith Connection 777. This is a general reading for the first half of March 2021. Hope you're doing well, Virgo. General readings aren't going to resonate with every single person. Keep that in mind. If you do want a private reading, I'm running a sale right now, $50. Normally they're $75. Go to my website, faithconnection777.com. I will link it below. For the entire month of March, 50 bucks. So let's see what's coming in for Virgo. What's going on with Virgo here, Spirit? March 2021, we have intensity. Something here it has your attention. Possibly needing to meet a deadline, lots of work around, lots of movement around a relationship or a job situation. Let's see what else we got here for Virgo. What else for Virgo here, Spirit? What else for Virgo here, Spirit? Oh, this is an interesting card. It says nothingness. There's nothing on the card. Interesting. Huh. I think that you want a break here, Virgo. I think that you have, you're working a lot. Your people in your life want your attention a lot. I think you just want to pull back and take a break. We have guidance number three. Needing some kind of direction here, needing to take a break, needing to relax. <laughs> so let's read the tarot and figure out what else is going on here. Messages of light and love come forward for Virgo here, Spirit. Let's see what's coming in for Virgo, March 2021. What's going on here, Spirit? We have the Nine of Wands. Okay, you've been putting, you've put yourself out there, possibly in a job or in a dating situation, and you're really feeling like this is a, like a kind of like a wounded warrior. Okay, <laughs> a lot going on around you, feeling like you're having to protect your heart. We have a King of Pentacles energy here. This is you, Virgo. Okay, a very um, content, stable, financially stable, and content, uh, yeah. basically an abundance here, not no stress. We have the death card, scorpionic energy here. Something here is coming to an end. Okay, bottom of the deck, we have the knight of swords, a very quick moving energy here. We will find out what this is all about. I feel like this might be a work reading, but we will gain some clarity here. What is this reading all about here for Virgo Spirit? I think it's possible, Virgo, if you have uh, people around you who are creating a lot of drama, creating a lot of urgency, trying to put a lot of... Um, I feel like... Virgo, if you're an empath, you have a situation where people around you are stressed out and they're like kind of trying to take over your energy a little bit. They're getting you stressed out when you are trying to maintain control and maturity over a situation here. What is this Nine of Wands doing here, Spirit? We have the World card. This is a completion of a cycle, okay? This is a pretty intense cycle that you've had to go through here, but this is the ending of it, moving into a better energy here as you complete this ending this could be an ending of a job too or a project something like that we have the six of pentacles some kind of partnership that you've been working on here has coming to an end possibly okay why is this king of pentacles here spirit whether this is work or a relationship we have a knight of pentacles okay so this is a slow moving energy towards your Basically, emotional stability. The King of Pentacles is somebody who 
um, is stable financially, doesn't get worked up, doesn't allow the stress around them of other people to affect their their mood. It's very mature energy here. And I feel like this is what you're trying to get to. This is a very slow moving energy though. This is something that you've been tested over for a while. Three of Pentacles here, okay? There may be a people around you, like three people possibly in a work situation that have been creating this stress around you. It's like they've really been helping you evolve, whether or not, <laughs> I feel like you might be annoyed with them. They, they get worked up over things that sh they shouldn't be getting worked up over. Page of Wands. Okay, you want to be in this lighter, happier energy where you're not allowing them to affect you. And this page of wands shows that you're really trying to get these people to lighten up a little bit. They're a little bit too intense. Tell me what this death card is for here. You have guidance from the spiritual realm helping you through this situation though here, Virgo. Whether or not you're aware of it, this is really supposed to help you evolve, okay? Okay. This ending here, this death card, this is an ending to something. Queen of Wands. Tell me more about this death card here, Spirit, and this Queen of Wands. This is you taking action on your life. This may be you deciding not to tolerate some of this behavior around you, this immature. like, And it's not that they're, these people are bad or wrong. I just think that they are really trying weighing you down. They feel, they feel like they're kind of high maintenance. Tell me about this death card here. This may be you needing to take the bull by the horns and um, put an ending to whatever is going on here. Knight of Swords coming out. So we have the Knight of Swords coming out twice. This is an ending coming here very, very soon for you, Virgo. This is in the works on your behalf. Four of Wands. You're going to be moving towards something a little bit more stable, okay? This emotional roller coaster is up and down. This feeling of urgency and stress and da ba da ba da it's not something that you really want to deal with anymore this is quickly coming to an end and you're moving towards something a little bit more chill okay <laughs> let's see what else justice card yeah things are going to be coming into balance for you virgo okay you shouldn't have to feel all of this crazy urgency knight of pentacles so i have fast moving energy slow moving energy okay Slow moving in the way that you're evolving, the way you handle these people. Um, you're, you're moving towards a mature energy here. And then the quick energy of moving away from these immature people or these people that are really putting a lot of pressure on you is really what I feel like here. Things are going to start coming into balance. You have karma playing out here because you've truly evolved. Okay. We have the six of pentacles. So we have the six of pentacles twice. Something here about a partnership is coming to an end for the purposes of giving you a stable stability, okay? Nine of Swords. This is really stressing you out, Virgo, okay? You don't want this to end because of money, because of... Um, you really want to be successful in this project that you're working on or these people that you're working with. You want to be successful with it. However, it's like... You're, you've done everything you can do here in this situation. These people are really the cause of the strife. They need to relax. <laughs> Tell me more, Spirit. Two of Cups. Yeah, so you have something here that's going to be a little bit better suited for you, okay? These people are... The people that you're with now, they, like I said, they, they may be a little bit immature. This page of wands, this might be an individual, a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, somebody who's younger than you that's trying to like take over or trying to uh, create a lot of strife for you. I think that you, you've, you've given yourself to this job or this project kind of like almost like a marriage. Okay. For some of you, this could be talking about not a work situation, but actually a partnership um like a romantic partnership this is for a few of you that's coming to an end here okay you feel like your stability is going to be shaken like the foundation of your work like you want to make sure that you're making enough money to survive and i feel like that's where the stress is being able to pay your bills but you need to trust that the spirit realm has your back and there are additional opportunities coming forward here that you don't need to worry 
here, Virgo, because you are completing out a cycle. And when you complete out a cycle, the spirit realm comes in and brings you a, another door opens up for you. Okay. This is something that's going to make you very happy. Some kind of new contract coming forward, a new business opportunity, a new job. Something here is going to be much better suited for you. It's not going to stress you out. This is going to be a much, um, these people are going to be more mature and they're going to, they're going to respect what you bring to the table without putting a whole lot of urgency. Like it feels like these people are questioning your ability. knowing you know what you're doing here, Virgo, but these people are questioning you and they don't even know what they're talking about basically. Okay. Tell me more. We have the eight of cups. Yeah. You may be just walking away, Virgo. You might find something that's going to be better suited for you. These people will stress you out way too much. It's time to let these people go, okay? When one door closes, another one will open, okay? You may just need a break as well. The intensity of this job and, yeah, four of cups. The intensity of this job is ridiculous. It's too much. Uh, you feel disappointed that things are playing out the way they are in this situation. Um, you really put your all into whatever this is. But these, you know, you can't control how these people react to you. They are the issue, not you, Virgo, okay? There is a little bit of disappointment here. But you need to understand that this was not a failure. This has really helped evolve you here, Virgo, okay? This whole situation has been a, a massive test for your ability to remain calm, your ability to show what you know, and to not allow other people's drama and energy affect you is really the point of this situation you've been dealing with here. Interesting reading. All right, Virgo, that's what I have for you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Hit the like button. Also subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.